obstacles to irrigation, challenges to producing hydropower, less hay, apples, and vegetables, and requests to limit how much water households use. That's what the newly released Pacific Northwest Water Year report shows Washington State faced after snowpack took a hit and rainfall didn't catch up. We saw much above normal temperatures in May of 2023. We saw a lot of rapid melt of our snowpack. Regionally, the picture was a little different. Southern Idaho and Eastern Oregon got a boost to reservoirs during Tropical Storm Hillary, bringing relief to at least some of the Pacific Northwest. It was actually finally some relief for that region because in previous water years, they had seen more of the uh, drought impacts. At a glance, Washington had its 23rd warmest and 20th driest year on record in 2023. Oregon had its 40th driest, Idaho its 58th. Researchers like Karen Bambacco hope doing a yearly impacts assessment will help agencies plan for how to handle water in future years. What does, you know, the lack of snowpack mean for drinking water or for fisheries, etc.? To prepare the report, partners across the Northwest surveyed agencies and found 50% have made changes to their long-term operations in response to trends in seasonal conditions. We know our climate is changing and this can help us better be better prepared and plan for future impacts.